Hi, I'm Rachel, and today we're going to be going over how to find angle measures and segment lengths. So let's say that you have a circle, like so, and the two segments that intersect form an angle, and you want to know what's the measure of that angle. Well, the measure is half of the sum of the intercepted arcs. So you have this arc, and you add it to this arc, and then you divide it by two to find this angle, or this angle, because these are vertical pairs, so they're gonna be the same angles, equal angles. Now let's say that the segments intersect outside of the circle at this point. Then it's going to be half the difference defines that angle, half the difference of the intercepted arcs. So you take this arc, you subtract this arc, and then you divide by two to find this angle. Because as you can see, it's much smaller. So that would make sense that it's half the difference. Um, and this arc is much bigger. Now, let's say you want to find the segment length. In this case, we have A, B, C, and D. Now, the length of the segments, if you multiply the products together, it's always going to be constant. So, A times B equals C times D, always. And that is how you can find the lengths of the segments. When the two segments intersect outside the circle, if this is A, this is B, this is C, and this is D, A times A plus B is equal to the product of C times C plus D. And that's how you can find the segment lengths when the segments intersect outside the circle. I'm Rachel, and thanks for learning with us today.